how to connect with an audience emotionally through video. This has to be one of my favorite topics and this is once you understand the principles that I'm about to share with you, your videos are never gonna be the same again, I promise, okay? So here's what you need to know. I'm gonna cover three things that you need to understand about creating videos that's ultimately going to have to connect with your audience, okay? So the first one is the old marketers saying of no like, and trust, okay? But I wanna break that down even further. What it actually means is you need to be generating content that creates three, that's focused around four different things, okay? And those four things to create no like, and trust are, you need to be generating content that generates conversations or is conversational, okay? So this may be questions that you ask um, and you're responding in a conversational tone, okay? The next point is inspiration. And when I talk about inspiration, I'm talking about things that you may have overcome that inspire someone to be able to take that same action or inspire someone to get out of the seat and do what it is they need to do. The next one is education. Um, so this may just be tips and tricks and bits and pieces that you're sharing from a place of um, you know, your experience and, and your knowledge of, you know, your particular industry or whatever the case is. And the last one is social proof. So social proof can be testimonials. It can be, you know, just examples of work that you've done to show that you're a fucking legend or that you're, you're good at what you do, right? And so if you understand how to generate content in these four ways, conversational content, inspirational content, educational content, and social proof content, then you're creating all of these different images and different ways of someone looking at you that will ultimately build the know, like, and trust factors. The next point that you need to know and understand to order to have your audience really connect with your videos is that you need to be vulnerable. And this shows strength as a human and, and as a leader, okay? Being vulnerable is such a powerful tool. And vulnerability used in the right way where you're giving insights into your journey, sharing bits and pieces about you, or you know potentially some of the things that have happened that have led you to where you are. This not only helps people to understand that you are a human, um, but you've also conquered those feelings, those emotions, those experiences, that if you do face them again, you're gonna be such in such a better place during that process as well. And the last thing is creatively show up in your own way. Be authentic and try new things, right? One of the things I know notice about people who have really stood out in their market with their personal branding or otherwise, is they've just owned who they are through and through. Okay, and there's no easier way to explain this other than just trying new things. Try different ways of expressing your message, or your purpose and what you do and connecting with your audience, okay? And if you take these three things, using the conversations, inspiration, education, social proof, different layers or, or different angles, being vulnerable and creatively showing up in your own way, as you and your your energy and everything else this is what's going to have you really connect through to an audience whether it's on an emotional level whether it's on an entertainment level or otherwise okay just be yourself be the best version of you and let your fucking light shine through whatever you do i hope these golden little nuggets helped i love you and leave you go get it